Hey dear friends, welcome back to the part 11 of JavaFX tutorial. In this section, I want to show you how you can work with tile layout. So, I want to create inside my create a class inside my flow layout demo for tile layout. I want to name tile pen demo. Okay, author is Muhammad Wafa and please subscribe to my YouTube channel youtube.com Barnamem So for tile layout I want to extend from tile pan Okay And I want to create a construct method so now I want to copy the previous code we work again I want to copy so okay private flow private rectangle rex and rex is equal to new rectangle with 50 and height also 50 let's copy this this because doesn't accept because we are not on declaration we are not initializing on declaration because so we need the rectangle here also So I want to add this side to super right that is that as list right. Why we don't have? Oh yes, called super must be at first here. Okay, so we cannot use it. We should use get children dot at all. But at all arrays as list rights. <clears throat> okay, what this I'm saying. So need Let's add this to our stack pan here. Okay. Also, let's run. Yes, it worked nice because we don't have the gap here. Set the gap. And also edge gap. Okay. 
Okay, that is working nice. As you can see, it works as like a flow pen. Okay, there is, as you can see, it works as like a flow pen. But there is, we have a method set brief columns. You can specify the column. For example, I want to make three. Now, as you can see, it doesn't work. I, I specify the column to three, but still it doesn't work. Okay. I want to make this greater. As you can see, it does. It doesn't work. The set brief column doesn't work. Okay. Also set brief rows also does not work. As you can see, it doesn't work. So why it doesn't work? Uh, because we put it our layout inside the stack pen. First, let's have an encore pen. Inside this encore pen, we should put our tile pen. Now. Now, as you can see, it works nice. Okay, but as you can see, you have three row. If I make this four. Uh, as you can see it doesn't work okay for rows but when you specify the column it is not responsive so let's clean this and also let's see again yeah it is as like this and let's make this three column now as you can see we have three column it works for pref column method if you make this two this will work again as you can see it works nice so thank you for your watching and see you in the next video. Goodbye.